my channel so today I'll be saying you guys a story and the story name is Goldilocks and the Three Birds. Um, it is my favorite story book and I love to read it and read it actually. Um, you should enjoy this video because I will be speaking in different voices because of the characters there are different characters in this movie, uh, um, story and um, allowed to read this for you guys um, so please like this video bring it to one lakh likes and subscribe my channel press the bell item that you can get to know when I come online so let's get started Goldilocks and the three bears once there were three bears father bear was a great big bear mother bear was a middle sized bear and baby bear was a little bear they lived in a cottage in the woods one morning baby bear woke up feeling hungry as usual he brushed his teeth and came skipping down the stairs he rushed into the kitchen and said what are we having for breakfast mother I'm very hungry. I made some porridge, dear, Mother Bear said. It, it's too hot to eat right now. Just let it cool for a while. But I'm hungry, wailed Baby Bear. Let's go for a walk in the woods. When we come back, the porridge will be ready to eat, said his mother. So the three birds went for a walk in the woods. Goldilocks was also taking a walk in the woods. She saw the cottage and said, I wonder who lives there. Goldilocks looked in through the window. She could see no one inside, so she opened the door and went in. Goldilocks saw a table set with three bowls of porridge. There was a great big ball, a middle-sized ball, and a little ball. First, she took a spoonful of porridge from the big ball. Ouch! This is too hard, she said. Then she took a spoonful from the middle-sized ball. Whoo! This is too cool, she said, and put down the spoon. Then Goldilocks tasted the porridge from the little ball. Mmm, this porridge is just right, she said, and she ate up all the porridge in the little bowl. In the next room, she saw three chairs. This is big chair, too hard, and this middle sized one is too soft, she said. Then she sat on the little chair. Mmm. This little chair is just right, she said. She began rocking back and forth on it. Suddenly, the little chair broke and she tumbled down with a crash. In the bedroom, she saw three beds. There was a great big bed, a middle-sized bed, and a little bed. This big bed is too hard, she said. And this middle sized bed is too soft. Then she lay down on the little bed. Oh, this little bed is just right, she said Goldilocks. And she fell asleep. The bears come back from the walk. They saw the door open. Who has been eating my porridge? said father bear who has been eating my porridge said mother bear and baby bear cried out someone has eaten my porridge then they went into the next room someone has been sitting on my chair growled father bear someone has been sitting on my chair too said mother bear baby bear sat on the floor and began crying 
Because his chair was broken into pieces, it was his favorite chair. His father had made it specially for him. Who could have broken it? said Baby Bear. He's crying. In the bedroom, they saw Goldilocks was asleep in Baby Bear's bed. She woke up and saw the three bears. She was so scared that she got up and ran away. And this was the story of the Goldilocks and the three bears. Uh, I don't know um, if you like this, but I love to read this one. I think you guys enjoyed this video and please like I said you first time. Um, and meet you in the next story. Bye.